Good evening, everybody. Theo Tetkalek with you. About a month ago, we sat down with the Wild. They were looking forward to going to a little place called Ottawa, Ontario. Nicknamed the Killer Bees because of these beautiful yellow jerseys they were presented with. Not only did they have a fantastic tournament, they went 6-0. A lot of goals for, and how many goals against? Zero. A little louder? Zero! That's right, zero. I've never gone six games and never had a goal scored against me, so fantastic. Well done, Killer Bees. They come home with a trophy, which the goalie is holding there, the 150 boys tournament there. Great job. Not only a little sugar on top, they also won the skills competition. Who was in the skills competition? All of us. Look at that. See? Team of 11, everybody in the skills competition. Teamwork at its best. 6-0. and We're going to go around the horn. First and last name in their best part of Ottawa and the tournament. Here we go. My name's Alex Manning, and my favorite part about Ottawa was probably the great food there. My name is Aiden Weeb, and my favorite part of the tournament was going to see a game playing in the Canadian Tire Center. My name's Keenan Borsay, and I loved all the games that we played and just having fun. My name is Austin Swall, my favorite part of Ottawa is probably playing in the Canadian Tire Center. My name is Ethan Clays, and my favorite part of the trip to Ottawa was playing hockey. My name is Natasha Drieger. My favorite part about the trip was playing with my team. My name is Rylan Keck. My favorite part of the trip was being able to bond with my teammates and get to know more about them. My name is Hayden Peters. My favorite trip, uh, part about the trip was playing in the Canadian Tire Center. My name is Logan. My fa Logan Mazinki. My favorite part of the trip is playing was playing in the Canadian Tire Center. My name is Sebastian Hicks, and my favorite part of playing in of playing uh, in Ottawa was uh, yeah playing in the Canadian Tire Center with my team and being champions. Hi, my name is Spencer Sabrin. My favorite part of playing in Ottawa was playing against all the teams across Canada. Great job, everybody. Playing teams from all across Canada. We played a team from Quebec, right? Northern Ontario, Alberta, PEI, Northwest Territories. Who was in the final? The Yukon. But they couldn't because you guys won. You players. 4 nothing was the final, right? Okay, for the players that played in the Canadian Tire Center, tell me how different it was playing in a seating capacity of 21,000 compared to an arena of 400? It was different, but the same size as this rink. So the same dimension. So you weren't worried about the seats. You were more worried about just the fact of the playing surface. All right. And I understand you were supposed to play a game outside. That didn't happen. That was okay. Okay. No, but did you guys get to skate on the ice at least? Yeah. yeah. Did you have fun? Yeah. What was the best part about the outdoor ice? It was uh, fun because it was not too cold that day because everyone was dressed up. But, yeah, just being there on Parliament Hill was pretty amazing. Very cool. Speaking of Parliament Hill, did you enjoy Parliament Hill? Yeah. All right, and we talked a little bit earlier about something that was taking you from Senate to maybe the underground. Pass this mic down. We got to travel in the, in the underground tunnels uh, to go to the main building. What were they used for? Uh, and the weather was like. Because there was a whole bunch of press and they had to like get away from it, so they would go in the underground tunnels so it would be quicker. Absolutely, great. Now bring the mic back over here. I'm going to talk to a gentleman, the first guy here. What's your name again, sorry? Alec. Alec, he talks to me about food. What was the best food spot in Ottawa? Probably the beaver tail stand. Okay, what was so great about the beaver tail stand? Well, is that it was it was kind of an original. It kind of felt like an it's it's an original idea in that there's so many flavors. Flavors of ice cream? Uh, no, it's like just almost anything, like apple, cinnamon, cookies and cream, anything like that. Sounds like heaven. I guess more of you enjoyed the beaver tail as well. All right, now a question for Logan here. Because he's the goalie that didn't let a single goal in. Did you notice the bright lights in the Canadian Tire Center different than at home? He, yeah, they were just huge and 
they got me distracted sometimes. Uh, not really. Sometimes. No. Because I was watching on the Jumbotron sometimes. <laughs> Wonderful stories by everybody. Lastly, I'm going to go around the horn one more time. You guys have had a chance to check out some sights and sounds. Can you name one of the best places you were in Ottawa outside of hockey? And then we'll let you guys get ready for practice. Okay, we'll start down below here. My favorite place? Your favorite place in Ottawa. Um, probably the Canadian Tire Center. There's a tie in between the outdoor rink and the Canadian Tire Center. The Sens House. Both Parliament and Sens House. I'd say the Canadian Tire Center and Parliament. Uh, the Parliament Building and the the skating rink. Parliament Hill. The Sens House. Parliament Hill. Parliament Hill and Canadian Tire Center. Probably a tie between the Canadian Tire Center and also um, the Canadian Air and Space Museum. Very good. So are you able to wear these jerseys or are these just your tournament jerseys? You go back to the wild jerseys? Once. You just use them once? Awesome. Well, there you have it. The Killer Bees, the Wild, 6-0 and champions, national champions, the first ever only inaugural Cap Bell Capital Cup, which is awesome. They got the banner to prove it. We're going to hang it high, I'm sure, somewhere. Congratulations, everybody. Well done. Thank you for representing Southern Manitoba so well. Have a wonderful evening. We'll talk to some of the parents and some of the coaches in a minute. Leo's talk luck with you. Manitoba Sports Network.